Hey guys, Micah here from ebikeschool.com. And today I've got something that I find really interesting that I want to share with you guys. Now, for those of us that ride e-bikes on the road with cars, really for anyone who even has to cross a road at some point, you guys know that cars are often the bane of our existence. You know, even at the best of times, riding with cars can be stressful, or at the worst of times, it can be downright dangerous. But what if, for once, all the cars just simply got off the road? I'm talking everything, you know, from back alleys to even big highways and interstates. Just no cars on the road, the road completely free and available for use by pedestrians and cyclists. Now, I know this sounds like, you know, some sort of crazy fantasy or a utopia or even dystopian future, depending on your views, but it's not. This actually happens where I live once a year for 24 hours. It's the holiday of Yom Kippur, which is the holiest day in the Jewish calendar. And here in Israel, uh, for that one day, nobody drives. And it's, it's not a law or anything, it's just that everyone observes this holiday, and for those that don't, they often respect the ones that do by not driving. So that leaves 24 hours every year with absolutely no cars on the road. Now this is the Ayalon, a major highway cutting through the heart of Tel Aviv, the city I live in. But starting this evening on Yom Kippur, it's going to look like this. Just cyclists and pedestrians as far as the eye can see. It's truly an amazing sight to see. And for those of us that are used to roads being basically the domain of cars and us as cyclists just sort of being allowed to use them as well, it's something that's you know, really hard to describe. And so instead of trying to describe this sensation to you, I figured it'd just be best to, to show you. Now, I personally don't film or use devices on Yom Kippur, but I'm going to show you a number of clips that other people have taken to give you a sense of, of what this really interesting and, and neat experience is like. It's really something, right? Now this will be my sixth year experiencing this as I moved to Tel Aviv back in 2012. But every year I find it, you know, amazing all over again. And it's actually also amazing for the environment because according to the Environmental Protection Ministry here, the pollution levels on Yom Kippur for 24 hours dropped by 99% in Tel Aviv and Jerusalem, two of the largest cities, and by over 70% in Haifa, the third largest city that has a mixed Jewish and Muslim population. So there is more driving there. But it's an incredible difference that it makes for the environment in just 24 hours when you remove all these cars from a metro metropolitan area. So if you guys ever wanted to experience what it's like to just ride freely on roads and interstates with no cars and no pollution for 24 hours, consider vid visiting Israel next year on Yom Kippur. It's a truly amazing experience. All right, last thing. Time for the weekly book giveaway, where I give away a free copy of one of my books, either the Ultimate Do-It-Yourself E-Bike Guide or DIY Lithium Batteries, How to Build Your Own Battery Packs. This week's randomly chosen commenter from last week's video is Brian Martin. So congratulations, Brian. Uh, send me a private message here on YouTube. Let me know which book you'd like and where I should send it, and I will send you your free copy. And if you'd like a chance to win one of my books yourself, just put a comment, anything you want, on this video, and hopefully you'll get chosen as the randomly chosen commenter in my next video. And if you don't want to wait, you can find both of my books on Amazon. All right, thanks for watching, everybody. See you next week.